guys welcome to back to our channel this is James and I'm Megan if you're new here and I am 22 weeks pregnant uh, I've actually felt a little bit better this week well energy wise um, at the beginning of the week I started feeling really good and actually got some of the housework done that I've been telling you that I needed to do and um, but but sadly I had I've been having dead. some nausea this week too that's coming back and I haven't had that in a few weeks so that was kind of disappointing but I have a lot of up, more updates for me and the baby too yeah yes the baby is the size of a papaya hold it up for everybody can see it James hold it up yeah it's got baby's the size of a papaya she's starting to look like a little miniature newborn yeah. now she's actually looking like a human <laughs> David always kind of laughed or he was like he never really wanted to know what the baby looked like it's funny because he, he it kind of mm -hmm. looked like an alien mm -hmm. before mm -hmm. but now it's starting to look like an actual human so he's more I think he'll be more mm -hmm. what are you doing uh, uh, uh. she's starting to look more like a little human instead of an alien I her lips, her eyelids, and her eyebrows are more distinct now. I've said in other videos where they were starting to form, now they're more distinct. Her eyes have forms, but they um, won't settle into their color until months after birth. She spends most of her time resting as I rock, rock her to sleep with my late daily movements. <laughs> from my daily activities she um she's asleep for about 12 to 14 hours a day are you leaving with my papaya oh yeah that's another thing i don't know what i'm going to do with this papaya now that i bought it if anybody had any good like recipes or anything to make it do you just i guess you just eat it raw i don't know so that's that's kind of something i've been wondering about i went to buy a papaya today and i was like what am i gonna do with this after the video we'll see when she isn't sleeping, um, she's trying to touch everything she can from her face to her body to her umbilical cord. Um, she's working on her physical abilities and her motor skills at the moment by practicing movement and she's getting and getting um, a feel on her on things right now. Uh, her inner ear has also developed to the point where she has a sense of balance and she also weighs about one pound right the best moment of the week right now what did you do with the papaya <laughs> where did the papaya go i don't take it away you took it away oh i hope i can find it um best moment this week is we went uh, my mom set up a little luncheon for me oh actually it was actually for oh you found the papaya okay that's good you want to bring it back to mommy yeah she had a um a luncheon it was supposed to be for my mother-in-law my sister-in-law my niece <clears throat> but um she invited me because she got really excited and later on she was like well, do you really want to come because it's going to be about your shower but i decided i want to come anyway so that it. was a lot of fun um I got a papaya. James came too and he did really good. He was really good. It was at a little um, tea room at an antique tea store. Or antique. And tea yeah, antique store. A tea and he did really good. Um, I bought yeah, some dumb. more it clothes dumb. for so it's the little, ba our little baby girl. Dog, so yeah, it went a little crazy it this week. And, it crazy this week. Uh, <laughs> and with her new clothes. I just, the little girl clothes are so cute. Little boys clothes have gotten better. You can still find some pretty cute little um, boy clothes, but little girls clothes, oh my goodness. My favorite is mud pie clothes. They're a little on the expensive side, but they're so cute. And I bought like three outfits this weekend of that and some other stuff. Also having more energy this week has been a good thing. And though this morning I woke up and I was just really tired, but for the most, uh, for the most part, I was able to have a lot more energy this week, so that's um, a really good thing. I'm excited about that. 
Also, a high point this week was this is the first time that I've actually had strangers come up to me and talk to me about my pregnancy. I was at the, my luncheon and I was walking around the antique store and I had like two or three different ladies stop me and ask me about my pregnancy. So that what made me feel good that I can, I'm actually showing now. I can, and it actually looks like a baby, not just little chubs. <laughs> Low moment this week was that my nausea has come back a little bit. I don't know if it's oh, um, Coco. Here we go because I haven't been eating it, but I haven't. We were to go in I've been eating decent. I mean, I don't know. It's not like I haven't been eating junk food a lot, but I do know that it, if I eat more protein, it does help me a lot. What are you doing? He's pushing me back. Um, uh, when I eat more protein, protein, it makes me feel better, and I really figured out that Greek yogurt, Greek yogurt. with pro extra protein in it, I found some like, that has a little sugar in it, because I know a lot of yogurt has sugar in it, and, or a lot of sugar in it, but I found this one like at the grocery store, actually, there, well, it's, there's different Tights, but this one I really like and I seem to eat it. I seem to feel better during the day and I had didn't have any last week So I went and bought some today. So I'm excited for that It's Bucky. Yeah, I want to show everybody Bucky. Now we gotta flip it around It's Bucky. If you don't know who Bucky is, it's a um, a uh, Gas station mascot here in Texas. They're starting to grow down in the south, but he loves going to see Bucky I'll have to do a video over Bucky because or Bucky's because it's actually it's, it's a, Bucky it's a giant Bucky, norm, Bucky. I can't see it baby a giant Bucky, enormous Bucky, Bucky, gas station Bucky, that has a cleanest restrooms Bucky, always joke that Bucky, you can eat off the Bucky, restroom floors Bucky. yes and James loves Bucky I love Bucky you love it. every time he goes like Bucky Bucky um more lows for <laughs> Knocking everything off his daddy's desk. Yeah, let's not break that. Okay. Other lows for this week is that I was getting ready this morning and I looked in the mirror and I was just kind of looking at my stomach and I saw something water on there and I was like, "What is that?" And I got closer to the mirror and I saw that I have a stretch mark. I was so proud of myself that I haven't had any stretch stretch marks this pregnancy yet and now I have one <laughs> um, so I went ran and I had some um, belly butter the cocoa butter for, for your belly and I rubbed a lot on there because I was just like I was so disappointed but I know it comes with pregnancy okay my wedding ring still on and my belly button is still in what I miss um, I miss waking up in the morning or going to sleep at night and then waking up in the morning and knowing that I'm probably going to feel good. But being pregnant this time around, I wake up not knowing, like, sorry, he's just singing in there. Um, not knowing if I'm going to feel good, if I'm going to have energy, if I'm going to be nauseous. So I do miss knowing that I'm, that not knowing how I'm really going to feel. James, you're... Jane, Jane's baby, you're being a little loud. Okay. What I look forward to, uh, I am looking forward to just dressing up my little baby girl in all her new little clothes. And because she's going to be like my little doll. And I'm just, I'm really excited about that. Be gentle with Simba. Don't, he's petting the cat. We okay, tell him he has to be gentle. There you go. Good job. All right, you want to tell everybody bye? Yeah. All right, every, if everybody, if you like Go this bye, channel bye, or you like this video, sorry, push the subscribe button bye, and hit button. that thumbs up. Bye, thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that bell. Bell. So you'll always be notified when I make bye. a new video. New video. All right, until next time. Bye. Bye.